Dear children, now is your bedtime story. Today, let us join the story of an adventure of a kitten called Ringo. Mrs. Fletcher has raised many cats in her house at a town called Flurry Mount. Ringo was born in a warm summer, but she does not look like her parents, who both have very nice snowy fur. Instead her fur was mixed with gray, yellow, brown. Mrs. Fletcher adore all the cats, but every time she saw Ringo, she would frown. Every day, all cats play with each other. They messed up with the place and Mrs. Fletcher would blame on Ringo. Ringo cannot understand why Mrs. Fletcher does not like her. Soon, Ringo grew to a nice cat like her parents. One day, one of the cats jumped on the table and the jar of flowers filled with water dropped on the carpet which Mrs. Fletcher just bought recently. When Mrs. Fletcher came home from market, she was furious. Without any thought, she just again shouted at Ringo and locked her up in a cage. She was punished with no dinner. She was so hungry that she just picked up the crumbs from the floor and filled her stomach. The next day, Mrs. Fletcher let her out of the cage, but she knows she will be blamed again next time sometime bad happened in the house. She knows she has to leave the house. Quietly she tiptoes out the house when Mrs. Fletcher was cooking in the kitchen. She just walked and walked for hours, and soon it was dark. She felt very sad. Suddenly she realized she had became a homeless cat. Tears fell down on her furry cheek. She found an empty carton and decided to spend the night inside. Next morning, the sunlight shone into the carton. She opened her eyes to found she was in another home. A little girl has walked past the street and found her very cute. She begged her parents to keep the cat and they agreed to it. Ringo was very grateful to the little girl. She decided to do her best to be her best company. She remembered Mrs. Fletcher's cat back home used to entertain her every day with rolls and jumps. She did the same, and soon she became her best friend. There was no more scoldings. Instead, she joined her new family at the dinner.